I'm Ami Horowitz, and I'm here in Berkeley, California, to find out if voter ID laws suppress the black vote. Do you have an opinion on voter ID laws? Uh, yeah, they're usually pretty racist and <laughs> they're bad. I think voter ID laws are a way to perpetuate racism. Would you say they're, would you go as far as to say they're, they're, those laws are racist? For sure. Do you think it suppresses the uh, African American vote? Definitely. Uh, because they're less likely to have state IDs. Minority voters are less likely to have the kinds of IDs that have been um, described or required. These type of people don't live in areas with easy access to DMVs or other places where they can get identification. You can always get IDs um, you do over the internet. Does that also would, uh, make it difficult for, for black people in particular? Yeah, you have to have access to the internet. You have to be able to pay an internet service provider for certain fees. Do you think that's harder for black people to go online? Well, IDs? I feel like they don't have the knowledge of how, of like, how it works. Like, a lot of people have smartphones, but you might not have data. For most of the communities, they don't really know what is out there just because they're not aware or like right. they're not informed. I also think there's a repression of like black voting with um, how they, how if you're a convicted felon, like you're not allowed to vote and everything. And when you look at swing states like Florida, that's a huge population of the of the like African Americans. Now I'm here in East Harlem to ask black people their thoughts on what you just heard. Do you have ID normally? You carry ID around? Yes, I have state ID. Do you carry ID? Yes, I do. Do you know anybody who any black person who doesn't carry ID? No. Everyone that I know has an ID. Why would they think we don't have ID? <laughs> That's a lie. Why would they say that? Do you have ID? Yes. Because I have my ID and my friends have their ID, so like, we know what we need to carry around. Everybody that I know have ID. Like, that's one of the things you need to walk around with New York with, an ID. Do you know any black adult who does not have ID? No, I don't. Is it a weird thing to even say that? Yes, it is. What is this, some, some type of uh, trick candy camera? I like know, that? right? <laughs> That's the only thing I brought with me. Those are legit, yeah. legit IDs. I heard a lot also that uh, black people can't figure out how to get to the DMV. Really? Is that, is that, what does that say to you? I know it's that. It's on 25th Street. Do you know where the ID, the, the DMV is around you? It's on 125th Street and 3rd Avenue, I believe. You know how to get there? Yeah. Do you have a problem getting there if you have to get there? No. It's, I know these sound like silly questions. You know how to get to the AV? Of course. You know where it is? Yes. You can get there? Uh-huh. No problem. No problem. Just checking. Okay. And I also heard a lot that black people, especially poor black people, have no access to the internet, can't figure out how to use the internet. <laughs> that's, that's, a, that's just stupidity, honestly. Everybody has access to the internet. Even a little kid can figure out how to work the internet. I had access to the internet for years. You know how to use it properly, right? Exactly. I do it at work. <laughs> so, of course, I know how to use it. Smart. My kids know how to use it. They all have iPads, iPods, whatever. Your phone has data? Mm -hmm. You can actually unlimited with, unlimited data. Mm -hmm. I use my phone as a hotspot. What does that say to you for the people who have this perception of black people? Um, uh, they're pretty much ignorant. Now. That's why my thought process on it. I just think that's ignorant. 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 That's the very, word. Very, very ignorant. Ignorant. Very, very ignorant. Does it sound racist for somebody to say that? I, I think it is a little racist because you know you're putting um, people in a category and you have no idea what you're talking about. Maybe a little bit of racist in it, but like I said, I think it's more stupidity and ignorance. You're judging somebody, like, but you're judging them because they're black, saying that they don't got it. What people are they talking to? <laughs> what are who are these people talking to? Do you have a problem that if you go to vote and they say, "Can we please see your ID to make sure you are who you say you are?" Are you love showing my ID? You have no problem with that? Nope. Would you have a problem if when you go to vote? If they say, can we please just see your ID to make sure you are who you say you are, do you have an issue with that? No. Would you have a problem if there was a rule where you have to show your ID in order to vote? I don't think so. No. Would you have an issue if there was a rule saying you got to show your ID before you vote? No. Are you cool with that? Yeah.